Hello and welcome to our overview of non-destructive testing and its methods and uses. Testing is a critical part of equipment maintenance. All testing methods fall under one of two categories, destructive testing and non-destructive testing. Destructive testing is any method that damages or destroys a component during the testing process. Non-destructive testing, on the other hand, is carried out without causing damage to the tested piece of equipment. The purpose of non-destructive testing is to assess an item's condition and performance quality while keeping the item in operating condition. The advantage of non-destructive testing is the ability to reuse the tested components or test on components still in operation. This allows organizations to gain all the benefits of regular testing with minimal waste. Non-destructive testing, also known as NDT, NDE, or NDI, uses various principles from scientific fields like physics, chemistry, and mathematics to test components individually or collectively. A wide range of industries use non-destructive testing due to the versatility and variety of testing methods. Let's review some of the most commonly used methods. Visual inspections are when equipment is inspected visually, sometimes with robots or drones fitted with cameras to assess their condition. Ultrasonic testing passes sound waves through a component to detect flaws and determine measurements. Vibration analysis measures vibration signatures to identify faults or abnormalities in rotating parts. Penetrant or magnetic particle testing is when liquids or magnetic particles are applied to a component where they gather near defects and cracks to highlight faults. Eddy current testing applies an electrical current to coils in order to measure consumption and identify anomalies. X-ray inspection and industrial computed tomography are used to generate detailed images of a component's interior to find faults and defects. Who performs a non-destructive test is dependent on what is being tested and why. These details determine the skill level required to complete the test. A visual test may be simple enough for a novice technician. However, a more in-depth test, such as industrial computed tomography, requires a technician with a high degree of specialization. Other team members that might conduct a non-destructive test include OEMs, quality assurance professionals, and maintenance team members. Regardless of who performs a non-destructive test, CMMS software like Limble can make testing more efficient and useful. By connecting to sensors retrofitted onto machines, CMMS software can schedule regular testing, analyze testing data in real time, and instantly trigger alerts when any sign of deterioration is detected. Pairing non-destructive testing with a CMMS is a valuable tactic for maintenance teams who need to ensure the safety, quality, and operability of their equipment. Thanks for watching and head over to limblecmms.com to learn more.